the wearing of face masks might actually promote some sort of immunity to COVID-19. It's a very interesting paper. It is, and it's getting massive traction. I mean, this this came out in the New England Journal, I think it was on Thursday, actually, which is the world's number one medical journal. Uh, These two scientists had had an idea or a hypothesis, if you like. And it looks really interesting, Pat. So so what it's all about is, it turns out, if you're wearing a mask, now we know masks work. I mean, the evidence is so, the scientific evidence is so compelling now. Anybody who denies masks, show me the scientific evidence against it, because the evidence on the other side is so strong. And now they're saying, look, there's something else about masks that might actually promote immunity. And you might wonder, how the hell can a mask make someone immune? Well, it turns out bits of virus still get out. In other words, masks aren't perfect. So tiny bits of virus get out and, and, and sadly infect someone else but guess what they have a very mild infection almost with no symptoms and they don't even know they have it because the dose of virus seems to be really important and now they might be protected you know what I mean in other words if you it's like a vaccine in a way now a vaccine usually involves a low dose of the infectious agent or one that's a bit milder you know and it's a bit like that they're they're comparing masks where mask wearing to almost like a vaccine and again there's some evidence to support this I mean a great one Pat was there was um, a cruise ship an Argentinian cruise ship and they put masks on the people because there was an infection and those who did get infected 80% were asymptomatic right so they they got a little mild infection Uh, on another cruise ship which didn't wear masks only 20% were asymptomatic see what I'm saying so in other words if you're wearing masks you might see a bit of a small spread of infection and the people won't have symptoms and then they might be protected so it's seen as another reason to wear masks it might actually promote immunity in the population so the the, the whole idea of this is that uh, you do get infected Uh, through your mask, uh, tiny amounts of the virus, but you still get a pretty good antibody reaction. Precisely. That's exactly it. And the evidence is on that cruise ship. They've done a study with hamsters. Again, as we say, we do animal experiments sometimes. If you put hamster... Now, by the way, Pat, this is some of the scientific evidence for masks. So if you, anybody who says don't wear a mask, tell them this evidence, that hamsters on one side of a cage, a mask in between this side of the cage and the other side, and then hamsters on the other side. And guess what? The ones on the far side didn't really get infected if there was a mask between them there's a very low infection and if they did get infected it was asymptomatic isn't that amazing so in other words a bit of virus got through the mask tiny level of infection and they had no symptoms and that that's animal it was not humans obviously but it's still good evidence so so that's right it's, it's as almost as if a tiny bit of virus is quite good because it might pr- provoke no symptoms and a bit of immunity